Hey, hi there everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Beetle Brad's channel. So good to see each and every one of you. I hope everybody's doing really well today. So glad to see you today, tonight, or this evening. I'm not sure when you're watching me, but you do. <laughs> it's great. All right, I guess you can tell from my caption down below, I'm in part two. Ringo Starr, peace and love. Part two of my Beatles and Solo Beatles picture discs. So, what do you say we get started and take a look at some fun picture discs? All right, Let's scoot around here. This is a real cool one. This is a Beatles Sgt. Pepper bootleg picture disc. Really like that. Isn't that just awesome? It's an alternate shot of Sgt. Pepper. And a different picture in the back as well. Here's your song listings. And if you saw my previous video, and I hope you did, I'd be awful sad if you didn't now, should I? <laughs> the White Album one I showed was just the White Album. It wasn't anything special. It wasn't anything different or unique. This one is all outtakes of Sgt. Pepper. And the outtakes on this one is just fantastic. It really, really is. I, I thoroughly enjoy this one a lot. Um, and so many of these are so beautifully done that they are suitable for framing, definitely. And now for my next one is this one. Still in the original shrink, still in its uh, plastic and everything. I haven't opened it. And this is actually quite rare. The Abbey Road picture disc. Very nice. Limited edition. <laughs> I know you saw that. I'm just, I'm just picking on you. <laughs> just having fun with you guys. <laughs> that makes it uh, kind of exciting and fun. Now we're branching off into solo Beatles. John Lennon. Listen to this. Okay, listen to this picture disc. <laughs> I couldn't remember what it was. And then listen to this picture disc as well. And that's side B. And this is basically interviews, and I forgot what else is on this. Ah, I don't remember. So if anybody out there has got this, Beetle Pro, have you got this? He may have this. Um, yeah, Tom, have you got that? Just wondering. But anyway, this is really cool. I took all of these out of the... Um, plastic wraps and I took them all out of their containers so it'd be a little bit easier to show them to you because it's it's awful hard to show those like the uh, Abbey Road one I showed you it's kind of hard when you get going like this and you start moving the glare and you start having the issue with all of all of that kind of twisting and turning all right my next one is John Lennon again and this is really uh, I couldn't see if I was in there if I was in frame or not um, from Milk and Honey Really cool. Great picture. Then on the back is a John Lennon photo. Awesome. Like I said, these are really cool. Just excellent. And there's your listing of what's on the album there. That kind of gives you an idea. Uh, not too many John Lennon ones. So we move on to Sir Paul McCartney picture discs. There's this one, which is really kind of cool. This is also a limited edition. <laughs> Follow along with me. It's a special word today. <laughs> Come on, boys and girls. You can say it. <laughs> Another picture disc you can get. I know, Beetle Brad is silly, but you know I'm having fun with you because that's the best part of, of collecting is sharing and enjoying what your collection is. You know, you may collect David Bowie, you may collect Led Zeppelin, you may, you know, collect the Kinks, Elvis, Beach Boys, Beatles, Stones. We all have a passion for what we collect, don't we? And like I said, I'm showing picture discs. Paul McCartney. And that's the other side. Uh, great picture. Great picture of Paul. Terrific. Really like I really like picture discs a lot. I'm continuing to still collect picture discs. I'm 
doing the best I can to find them, and it's a never-ending process, I think. Okay, this one is from UK, Bad Glare. See, that's why I see, this is why I take them out of the plastic, because you guys get such a glare that I'm going to take it out for you. This is a UK one, like I said. Um, this is it. But look at look how cool this is cut out. See the shape of this? See the, to the shaping and all that? Isn't that just neat? I love it the way they did this. There's the back. And it's Rupert the Song, which is a Paul McCartney song. Um, Rupert is a whole lot more popular over in the UK than it is here in America. America, Rupert really didn't take over because we really pretty much had uh, Mickey Mouse. And it was kind of hard to compete with a good old Mickey. But that's all right. So this is really cool. Like I said, I love the shape of that. Just something unique and different. That just makes it more of a fun to collect it because it is fun and different. All right, next, glare one up. See, told you glare, glare. All right, now we're going back again for that limited edition. <laughs> I think this one's... Ah, it doesn't say it on it, but it is a limited edition, and it is very hard to get. Band on the run. Um, it's still in its original shrink wrap. I have not taken it out at all. So this is the regular band on the run. I have, like I said, you know, and I want you typing in and going, what's it sound like? I haven't taken it out of the wrapper, <laughs> out of the plastic. <laughs> Some people don't listen to me when I'm talking, you know. Okay, this is a, another Paul McCartney picture disc of No More Lonely Nights. We'll take this out. Got a little bit better picture of showing you this one than the than the glare. Pretty cool, huh? There's your song listings of what's on that. Very nice. Broad Street, Paul McCartney. If you haven't noticed already, this is mostly domineering of uh, Paul McCartney. <laughs> picture disc. Yes, it is. This one is from the fabulous UK. I'm going to take this out of its plastic to start off with because it's just kind of hard. Um, this is another one from Broad Street. Let's so get these pictures straight for you. Another one from Give My Regards to Broad Street with Ringo Starr on that one as well. And then that's also a picture right here of the late Linda McCartney. So sad. Wow. Um, but yeah, Linda McCartney on that one. Then there's this one. Literally, this one. Um, and it's limited edition, that kind of thing. This is what's on it. If you could read that, all right. That's kind of a cool picture. This is kind of a stretch of a picture disc, but you know, this is my video and I'm going to stretch it. <laughs> so there. This is very limited, quite cool, and I believe Marv has this in his collection. Well, there's the record. I'm trying to get out of this so you can, so you can see it. There's the record. Okay. Now, do you remember the image of what I just showed you? So on this side, there is no music, but on this side is kind of like a picture disc of the front cover. So you're getting all that. I really hope it shows up. I think yeah, I think you're getting it. That's probably better, isn't it? But see that? Isn't that cool? One of my favorite, but this is etched into the record. So I kind of consider this a picture disc, even though it's really not an actual picture disc, but for my video, it's a picture disc. <clears throat> okay, moving right along. Now we're going into Paul McCartney... 45s and this was during Paul McCartney's album of Flaming Pie and these are 45s so there's this one and then we flip it over and there's this side very nice and like I said here's the sleeve and these were kind of a limited edition as well I don't have all of them but I have most of them the next one for Paul McCartney. 
the back side for the words. If you need to pause this so you can see what the word or the song is, go ahead and pause on your own, okay? Little helpful tip there from your friend Beetle Brad. <laughs> there we go. Cool, huh? In green with a little heart in the middle there on the other one. Then there's this one. And the backing. Like I said, go ahead and pause. This is really cool. Um, great one as well. Love the love the 45 of this. There's that one as well. Very cool, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. <laughs> like I'm talking to Bentley, my puppy. <sighs> All righty, everybody. Um, if you wanted to see part one and you didn't get to see that, the number on number one is uh, 241 if you want to see part one of my picture discs. But like I said, this is part two. As far as I know... I think that's all of my picture discs. No, I don't have any Ringo Starr or George Harrison solo uh, picture discs. I'm still in the midst of looking for some. Um, there aren't too many of George or Ringo out there. Yeah, I know I'm, I'm missing. I think I've got a George Harrison one, but I just can't find it. So who knows? It may just show up in another video. But anyway, I thank each and every one of you. Uh, for watching. Subscribe to my channel. Let me know what you think of the picture disc. Did you like the segment of picture discs? Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> so I'm glad you enjoyed it. Glad you tuned in to Beetle Brad to watch my picture discs. Uh, got a lot more great stuff coming up. You'll be surprised at some of the uh, locations that Beetle Brad's getting ready to go to. So like I said, subscribe to my channel. Thank you, my subscribers and my viewers, very, very much. Without you, I wouldn't have a channel. And I do appreciate it. And I do enjoy showing each and every one of you my videos and what I have in Beetlewise. I'm not, not out to compete with anybody or show my collection to be bigger or better. I'm just some guy who's enjoying his collection and wanted to jump in on YouTube and just wanted to show what I've got. Um, there are people out there that are much better professional video people than me, and they're a lot more uh, skilled in all of their albums that they've got, and they've got a lot better way of doing it. But I'm just being myself and coming into your home or work or wherever you are watching this. Uh, hopefully not at school. I hope you're not at school watching me. <laughs> you should be doing your schoolwork. So, but I wanted to say thank you very, very much for tuning in to Beetle Brad. And as I say on my channel, I'm out of here. Take care, everybody. See ya.